and continue to read a spot young reading Alibaba and the 14 tips. Chapter 2 The Tips Return Gon A taught Kasim <coughs> he hired ten donkeys and took them to the place Alibaba had described. Open, says to me. He cried. The rock opened and and Kasim stepped into the cave. He was dazzled by all the chairs. I want everything. He stuck his back full then turned to leave, but he'd forgotten the magic word open strawberry. He cried, nothing happened. Kasim was chapped, was still. He couldn't hear voice, voices outside. He wanted to hide, but he was frozen with fear. Suddenly, the rock opened. Get him, man! Shout the ladder of the tips. He know a secret. Chop him up and lift his body to scare other people away. That night, Kasim, Kasim didn't come home for supper. His wife has worried. She... She went to Alibaba's house in tears. I think Kasim is in trouble. He, she will. Please buy him. I hope he wasn't, hasn't gone to the cave. Morning, morning came and there was still no sign of Kasim. Alibaba went to look in the cave. Open sesame, he called. The rock slid back to to reveal a horrible sight. Kasim's body lay in four pieces. Alibaba quickly put them in the bag and hurried home. I can hurry my brother in pieces. He thought he went to ask Kasim Law Steven Morgiana for help. I know just the man for the job. Morgiana went straight to must uh, the tailor. I need you to sew up him, sew up something in secret. She said, I will pay you well, but you must let me blindfold you. <coughs> Mustafa agreed he needed the money. Morgiana led him to Alibaba's house and made him sew up Kasim's body. Soon, Alibaba was able to bury his brother in one piece. He planned he pretend, pretended that Kasim had died of an illness. Would you like to work for me now? Yes, please. 